Okay, let's see solve this equation. So this kind of equation, um, we want to put x with x, okay? The number with number. So what we do is we want to get rid of reason by x from this side. How to get rid of it? We raise by one over x. Then we have, because x times one over x is two, just one. So we get two raised by one. Then this side we have x raised by 32 multiplied by one over x. But we want to associate x with one over x. Then raised by 32. So now we can raise both sides by, because we want to associate the number with the number, so we would uh, raise both sides by one over 32 to get rid of this 32 on the right hand side. Because 32 times one over 32, that's one. So we have x raised by one over x on the right hand side. Two raised by one over 32 on the left hand side. Now what do we have to do is we have to match up. So if we can, if we multiply two over two, right, we get a two raised by two over 64. That we can write as two squared raised by one over 64. That's x raised by one over x on the right hand side. So now that's a four raised by one over 64 equals to x raised by one over x. So now, yes, we need the base and this, the denominator in the exponent to be the same. So maybe again, let's multiply by two over two until we get the base and the denominator of the exponent to be the same. So then we have four raised by two over six, four times two, that's 128. And you put the x raised by one over x. Now we want to apply this two to four because we want to write as two squared raised by one over 128. X, x raised by one over x. So four squared is 16 raised by one. Okay, we're getting close. Now you see, so the one more step. We'll be done. Now we multiply by two over two again. We multiply two over two again. Now sixteen square. So we got a sixteen square. And then one over two fifty six. And sixteen square is indeed two fifty six. So two. We have two fifty six raised by one over two fifty six. Now the pattern matches. The right hand side, so x equals to 256. That's it. Yeah, x equals to 256.